Hey everyone, my name is Fez and today I'm going to show you how to make a camera wrist strap just like this. So basically, when you wear this, um, if you're ever taking some pictures or some videos and you let go of your camera, it's the camera's not going to go too far because it's connected to the bracelet on your wrist. You're going to need a few materials for this one, one of which is a, a lighter, um, a pair of scissors to cut off any excess cord, um, some paracord of course, 550. I'm using around 6 to 7 feet, somewhere in the middle. You're going to want more or less depending on your wrist size and how much gap you want in between the bracelet to the camera. You're also going to need a split ring just like this to connect the two together. Alright, let's start off the tutorial by finding our two ends of paracord, running our fingers through the cord, and Stopping at this loop right here. You want to hold that tight with your fingers. Run these through uh, ends through that. Just like this. Uh, try to straighten it out and make sure the cords are even and like not twisting up like how they are on camera right now. <laughs> but um, yeah, try your best to do that. Okay, once you've got that out of the way, um, this is what's going to determine how much bracelet you get from the, the loop to, um, to wherever you want to stop. So um, just be aware that this is how much bracelet you get, and it's also um, going to determine the length between uh, the bracelet to the camera itself. So I think I'll keep around that much for myself. Yeah, that should be good. Okay, once you've determined that, you want to put the left strand on the left side and the right on the right. And then we can begin weaving. So we'll start with the left strand. Basically, you just want to put the left strand on top of the, the two middle strands and create a small loop right here and then you want to take the right strand put it over that left strand put it under the two middle strands and through the loop you made on the left side make sure you're always uh, holding the the loop so you don't um lose where you want to uh, your bracelet to end and then just tighten it and then there you should be able to let go of your uh, loop now and this is how much bracelet you're gonna get okay now we'll do the left side or the right side my bad put the right strand over the two middle strands take the left strand put it over that put it under the two middle strands and through the loop on the right and then just tie everything up. Put the left strand over the two middle strands. Take the right one, put it over that, under the two middle strands, and through the loop right here. And then tighten it just like this. Put the right strand, put it over the two middle strands. Take the left strand, put it over the, the right one, put it under the two middle strands and through the right loop. <coughs> Voice cracks. Damn it. Alright, now just tighten everything up and um, yeah, your brace is going to look something like that. Alright, so this is what I've got so far. I've weaved it all the way through until I literally wasn't able to because the strands are so tiny. So I can put it on my wrist and tighten it just like this. And this is kind of how it's going to look. 
But we have some extra strands which we need to cut off. And that's where our scissors come in handy. Just carefully grab them and then cut them off. And then do the other side. And then grab your lighter and lightly heat the ends of where you just cut. Just give it a second to cool down and it should be good. There, now you get somewhat of a cleaner finish than with the strands sticking out. And you're basically done. All you have to do now is, um, if you haven't already, attach the, the what do you call it, the split ring to your uh, camera. See, I already did it over here. So now the last step to do is grab that middle loop thing, feed it through the, the ring, and then basically wrap your whole bracelet around it, and then tighten it. And that's it. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. Um, if you have a second, please subscribe and uh, yeah, give me a comment down below or hit the thumbs up or thumbs down. And yeah, bye.